Hey everybody, welcome, my name is Kevin Jones and this is the Beginning Hunter video series here on YouTube. My goal with this program is to educate and inform you on everything that you will need to know about becoming a new hunter. Today we're going to be rev reviewing a pair of binoculars that I bought about three years ago. So the, uh, the time in the field has been tried and true. These are the Zeiss Terra ED 10 by 42 binos. So before any review, I always like to show kind of what it looks like when you get the package. So this is what it looks like. All right, as you can tell, I've had this one for quite a while, so I've scuffed up the box for a long time. I uh, just like to do once over. So, without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so the binoculars themselves actually come in this kind of cool little travel case. Um, when you purchase them, I have not really used this case very much. I always just keep my binoculars in my chest rig. So, I just kind of want to throw that aside, that, or uh, throw that in, that this is... A part that comes with the kit, throw it over there. So this is it. It's a it's a pretty basic standard looking set of binoculars. Um, again, these are the 10 by 42 Zeiss Terra EDs, and um, I've had these for three years. And there was a couple of things that kind of drew me to these. One is that Zeiss is one of the leaders in um, binocular um, manufacturing and um, binocular production now. One thing that I do need to note right off the bat is that my little Zeiss emblem, after three years, they find it finally actually fell off um, about about a month and a half ago. Um, luckily, it fell off in my truck, so I still have the little emblem. I just have to glue it back on. Um, but in order to keep these reviews uh, brutally honest, that's that's what happened. The little emblem came off. So um, I'll kind of show you around here. Um, it's a standard binocular. I don't really think I need to go into any explanation. Um, there's a couple things that I do want to note, though, is that um, these, though they, um, although Zeiss is a German company, and um, and although they have the standard set with these binoculars, it actually, when you open them up, right here, you can't quite see it, but it says China. So these are actually made in China. Now, when I asked them about this, I said, hey, it, you know, it's a German glass, but why, why the heck are they made in China? They said that they have to outsource the work to China so that these binoculars can be more affordable to us. So keep that in mind. They said it's still the exact same German engineering standards, the same specifications. Um, everything's still the same as far as the quality, but they are cheaper. And when you hear the price point on these things, you will actually understand why. So again, Zeiss Terra EDs, um, they're really a great price for what you get. Um, are there other options out there as far as binoculars? Of course. Um, but I would be really hard-pressed to find the same, the same quality of craftsmanship that Zeiss has on any of their products. Um, so to, to kind of get into the, the nerdy-wordy stuff. So, so these are 10 by 42, so you have a 10 times the magnification, right? So what that means is at about 1,000 meters, you're looking at something as if it's about 100 to 110 meters away. Um, these are waterproof, the body at least is waterproof. And these are really good and ideal in temperatures from anywhere from like 24 degrees to 140 degrees. Um, really, I mean, they feel really good when you're holding them. Um, and the view in these things are, it's really crisp. You don't get any, any weird glares or haze or anything like that. The reason why I purchased new binoculars is because my old binoculars, I was starting to get headaches after I would, um, be glassing for 45 minutes. I'm starting to get headaches and eye aches. Um, so I purchased these and all that stuff went away. And I can, I can literally sit and glass for as long as my butt cheeks can stand it before they fall asleep. So get in, getting into the price now. So these are $499 on Amazon. So 500 bucks, we'll round up. They can be found cheaper, um, shop around. Um, I always like to go to Amazon because in, you know for this, uh, review video, um, they always have the most data. So of all the people that have bought these on Amazon, um, they are ranked at a 4.8 out of 5. So a lot of people like them. Um, I do too. There's nothing, I've, I, like I said, I've had these for three years. I've taken them on elk hunts, antelope hunts, mule deer hunts, bear hunts, you know, coyote hunts, whatever hunt, turkey hunts, and they've never let me down. They are, it's, it's good glass. I would recommend it. Shop around. You can typically find these things on sale too um, because these are um, the entry level binocular for Zeiss. So just, um, yeah, give it a shot. I really, it doesn't have to be the binocular that you do buy. 
that if you um, are out there shopping, at least give this one a look. Um, I'll go ahead and attach the link to the Amazon page uh, below. So if you wanna go take a peek, um, do your own research, I would highly suggest it. So that's it for me today. Again, my name is Kevin Jones, and this is the Beginning Hunter video series here on YouTube. Um, if this is helpful to you, consider leaving me a like. If this was extra helpful to you, consider following the page, and I will be generating a lot more content like this in the future. So until next time, we'll see you then. Bye.